Mama Oracle, that word on association is timely. Mm. Indeed, as Proverbs 27, 17 states, iron sharpens iron. Oh, yes. You know, uh, one thing you need to understand is association brings assimilation, which brings impartation. That means you cannot be different from those whom you closely associate with. That is why Amos 3.3 3 also says two cannot work together unless they are agreed. And that is why today I was focusing on uh, relationships, focusing on the people that God needs to bring into our lives. Because the people in our life, they are either a blessing or a burden. The people in our life, they are either a help or a hindrance. The people in our life, they either exalt us or exhaust us. The people in our life, they either increase us, decrease us, or neutralize us. So we've got to be careful about the people that we allow into our life. When God wants to bless you, he sends a person but when the devil wants to destroy you, he also sends a person. And that is why I'm praying for very high discernment concerning the people that are coming into our life. You know, the Bible is clear. It has not told us to make everybody our friend, but it has told us to love our neighbor. That means love is a must, but relationship is by choice. I can love you, but that doesn't mean I have to make you my friend. And one prayer I'm praying even to those that are watching us uh, tonight that God will give them grace to disconnect uh, from toxic relationship because toxic uh, relationships they kill your joy toxic relationship they kill your vision they kill your dream toxic relationship kill your faith in God and when toxic people live your life toxic things uh, stop happening and when right people come into your life right things begin to happen there are people today that are in jail because they met the wrong people there are women today that are single mothers because they met the wrong people. There are people today that their businesses went bankrupt because they met the wrong people. And one prayer I am praying is, Lord, in the remaining months of this year, connect us with the right people. And every evil connection, Lord, disconnect us in the mighty name of Jesus. So association is so timely because our association, it can either be a destruction or it can lead to our destination. So we've got to be very careful whom we associate with.